Today I'm going to show you how you can make the perfect acai bowl. I made this one the other day and it was so good that I decided that it deserved its own video. You have probably heard of or maybe had an acai bowl before because they're so popular right now. And if you don't know what it is, it is basically a really thick ice creamy smoothie in a bowl. And one of the main ingredients is the acai berry. It is a dark berry that is native to the northern South America and they have a lot of antioxidants which is amazing and you might be able to find like more local berries with the same health benefits but it tastes really good as well and it's just a nice little treat every now and again. In most parts of the world you can buy acai either in frozen form or in a powder form. I have both here but I have to say that I definitely prefer the pulp, the frozen one. And there might be differences between different brands of the powder, but this one did not taste very good at all. And I found my frozen pulp in like a special health food store, but depending on where you live, some supermarkets may actually have them as well. Some of them are filled with sugar though, so you should just be sure to check the label before you get them. And now with that out of the way, let's just move on to the ingredients. So you will need half a banana and make sure it's really ripe so it's sweet. Then you will need a few chunks of frozen mango. I use maybe like two thirds of a cup or something like that. And then some coconut milk. You can use whatever kind you would like, but I like this one. That is a little bit more thicker than the kind of drinking type of coconut milk. I just start with adding a little splash. Don't want it to be too runny, so it's easier to add more liquid as you go. And then of course I used acai, I used one frozen pack which is 100 grams and then finally I used a handful of frozen blueberries. So from this point everything is just super simple, you just want to add all the ingredients to a blender and it really helps if you break up the frozen acai a little bit so it's easier for your blender to just process and mix everything. And then you just want to blend it up and I didn't have quite enough liquid so my blender was struggling a bit. So I just added a little bit more water or you can add more coconut milk if you would like that instead. And as you can see that helped a lot and everything blended up nice and smoothly. So then it's time for topping, the most fun part. And here it is completely up to you, you can use whatever you would like. I used a two birds buckwheat and chia blend and some almond butter, blueberries, granola and some banana and nectarine pieces. So just add your smoothie to a bowl and then add all of your toppings and voila! <laughs> you have the perfect breakfast, dessert or anytime snack or treat. It is so delicious and the blend of all the fruit with the coconut and all the toppings is just wonderful. Please let me know if you tried this out, you really should. And tag me in any pictures on Instagram if you make it. I hope I'll talk to you again in another healthy tasty video next week. And yeah, bye!